Dear first year Audrey, congratulations, you made it to university. You're excited about the promise of adventure, of meeting your people, of paving a successful career, but you're nervous. Even though you worked so hard to get to where you are now, about to study law, and having moved into state from Melbourne to Canberra, you still feel like you being here is some kind of fluke. You worry about how you'll fit in, at college, in classes. And every time you look around a classroom, or a lecture theatre, or a dining hall table, you feel like everyone around you is a mastermind, who has their whole life together, and is on a superhero trajectory to success and you feel less than that. You're nervous to talk about your experiences, your thoughts and ideas, because you feel like they're not as valid or eloquent or intelligent as those of others. I'm here to tell you that, first and foremost, it's all going to be okay. So you can take a breath. You should recognize that you worked really hard to get to where you are now. It doesn't make you arrogant or conceited to acknowledge that you're a hard worker, you're ambitious, and that you deserve to be here studying law at ANU just as much as the people around you. And in fact, so many people feel just like you. In a few months, you'll start to speak to your friends and peers about this anxiety that you feel, and people around you will agree with you. You'll recognize that these barriers that you feel are abstract and that there's a term to describe how you feel, imposter syndrome. Here are some tried and tested tips from 2022 me to overcome your imposter syndrome. Firstly, getting into a mindfulness routine will help you to manage your stress. You'll start rowing and this will provide you with both a physical outlet and a team, a sense of community. You'll get into journaling, which will help you to reflect on the journey you're on and to process the highs and the lows. Secondly, you will embrace the feeling of connectedness that comes from being around people who are on a similar journey to you, despite their different pasts and perspectives. You'll find comfort through sharing stories, seeking advice and hearing from your peers, family, co-workers and teachers. You should know that it's okay to seek help and that speaking up can open enriching conversations with those around you. Most of all, I want you to believe in yourself. You'll hear some great advice in a few months. You have to be in the race to win it. You'll learn to back yourself. And even when it doesn't come intuitively, you will get better at trusting what you're capable of. We're still learning, but three years later, this belief has gotten us further than you will imagine. I don't want to spoil it, but I can't wait for you to see where we are now. I would wish you luck, but I know you don't need it. You can do this. You're going to love the feeling of having the world at your fingertips and to be backed by an incredible community around you.